The dog's owner is speaking out. She wants to make sure that no other dog or potentially a person gets hurt. It happened so fast and yet it felt like an eternity. Ashley Williams recalls a frightening attack on her dog, Logan. Surveillance video from a nearby business shows Ashley and Logan walking on Main Street July 29th. Suddenly, two pit bulls dart across the street and jump on Logan. So the white one was trying to grab his leg because he was, he was flipped over like this. So the white one was trying to grab this leg in this area, but I was kicking him so he couldn't get to it. The brown one had him by this and he was just pulling and pulling and pulling. A woman who follows the dogs tries to break it up, but William says it wasn't until a few passers-by stopped that the ordeal ends. I remember kicking and I was hitting as hard as I could. I was doing everything I possibly could, um, but it was chaos. Logan escaped with a small cut to his ear, but William says the pair of pit bulls are a danger. A week before the attack, she says they ran from the house unleashed, but someone stopped them. The entire community should feel safe to walk up and down that street. There are so many. There's children. There's elderly people, there's mothers with strollers. The town's animal control officer says the incident is under investigation with results expected by the end of the week. He says no prior complaints against the dogs have been filed. I do not have personally any problem with pit bulls, the breed. It's not about the breed. It's about these two specific dogs that have a temper that is not safe for this community. We tried to reach the owner of the pit bulls. There is a dog license on file with the town. That's good for 2019, but was not renewed for 2020. The phone number on file associated with that license does not appear to be working. Live in Clinton, Sarah Conji, WCVB.